Yechezkeel, Ezekiel 37. The hand of Yahuwah was upon me, and carried me out in the Ruach Yahuwah, and set me down in the midst of the valley, which was full of bones, and caused me to pass by them round about, and behold, there were very many in the open valley, and lo, they were very dry. And he said unto me, Son of Adam, can these bones live? And I answered, O Adonai Yahuwah, you know. Again he said unto me, Prophesy unto these bones, and say unto them, O ye dry bones, hear the word of Yahuwah. Thus says Adonai Yahuwah unto these bones, Behold, I will cause eth breath to enter into you, and ye shall live, and I will lay sinews upon you, and will bring up flesh upon you, and cover you with skin, and put breath in you, and ye shall live. And ye shall know that I am Yahweh. So I prophesied as I was commanded. And as I prophesied, there was a noise, and behold, a shaking, and the bones came together, bone to his bone. And when I beheld, lo, the sinews and the flesh came upon them, and the skin covered them above, but there was no breath in them. Then said he unto me, Prophesy unto the wind, prophesy, son of Adam, and say to the wind, Thus says Adonai Yahweh, Come from the four winds, O breath, and breathe upon these slain, that they may live. So I prophesied as he commanded me, and the breath came into them, and they lived and stood up upon their feet, an exceeding great army. Then he said unto me, Son of Adam, these bones are the whole house of Yashareel. Behold, they say, our bones are dried, and our hope is lost. We are cut off for our parts. Therefore prophesy and say unto them, Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Behold, O my people, I will openeth your graves, and cause you to come up out of your graves, and bring you into the land of Yashara'el. And ye shall know that I am Yahuwah when I have opened up your graves, O my people, and brought you up out of your graves, and shall put my ruach in you, and ye shall live, and I shall place you in your own land. Then ye shall know that I, Yahuwah, have spoken it and performed it, says Yahuwah. The word of Yahuwah came again unto me, saying, Moreover, son of Adam, take you one stick, and write upon it, for Yahudah and for the children of Yashadael, his companions. Then take another stick and write upon it, for Yosef, the stick of Ephraim, and for all the house of Yashadael, his companions, and join them one to another into one stick, and they shall become one in your hand. And when the children of your people shall speak unto you, saying, Will you not show us what you mean by these? Say unto them, Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Behold, I will take at the stick of Yosef, which is in the hand of Ephraim, and the tribes of Yashadael, his fellows, and will put them with him, even with at the stick of Yahudah, and make them one stick, and they shall be one in my hand. And the sticks whereon you write shall be in your hand before their eyes. And say unto them, Thus says Adonai Yahweh, Behold, 
I will take uh, the children of Yashadael from among the heathen, whither they be gone, and will gather them on every side and bring them into their own land. And I will make them one nation in the land upon the mountains of Yashadael, and one king shall be king to them all. And they shall be no more two nations, neither shall they be divided into two kingdoms any more at all. Neither shall they defile themselves any more with their idols, nor with their detestable things, nor with any of their transgressions, but I will save them out of all their dwelling places wherein they have sinned, and will cleanse them. So shall they be my people, and I will be their Elohim. And David, my servant, shall be king over them. They all shall have one shepherd. They shall also walk in my judgments and guard my statutes and do them. And they shall dwell in the land that I have given unto Yaakov, my servant, wherein your fathers have dwelt. And they shall dwell therein, even they and their children and their children's children forever. And my servant David shall be their prince forever. Moreover, I will cut a covenant of peace with them. It shall be an everlasting covenant with them, and I will place them and multiply them, and will set eth my sanctuary in the midst of them forevermore. My tabernacle also shall be with them. Yea, I will be their Elohim, and they shall be my people. And the heathen shall know that I, Yahuwah, do sanctify eth Yashedael, when my sanctuary shall be in the midst of them forever.